Well, that's uh, after a week of theremin practice. Uh, this is a theremin. Um, we built it uh, over the last couple of weeks. Some of you might have seen my uh, web posts about building theremins. Um, I bought it from a kit from Harrison Instruments, and they sell built theremins uh, for about $10 less. You can build your own if you know how to solder and put things in boxes, which I know uh, it wasn't very good at. So I had my friend Lauren Horn, who was in the area, come out and help me solder the motherboard. So if you uh, open this up, this is just a cigar box that uh, my friend Tom Machowski gave me, and it was perfect for the project. And what you have inside is a little 9-volt uh, uh, battery and a uh, motherboard that does all of the things that theremins used to do with tubes. And then you have uh, an output for, uh, for a um, amplifier and a tone control on the side. And it uh, has this little antenna on the top that uh, basically uh, radiated some magnetic field. And it's the field that you're messing with when you play with the theremin. So uh, I am having a lot of fun with it. And uh, I think I'm going to keep uh, practicing and see if I can't uh, create some spooky music for Halloween. Uh, let's give it one more try here. Okay, rift into a little Star Trek there. Uh, Ed Young asked me to play Dazed and Confused on this thing, but I'm afraid that's going to take uh, a little more practice uh, back at you when that happens.